It's time. Let's finish this. Secret Invasion Episode 5, which similarly left storylines lingering in the lead-up to the show's sixth and final episode, did not buck this tendency. Easter egg-filled Secret Invasion Episode 5's plot concentrated on the events following Talos' passing, and Fury's struggle to find allies among those he formerly considered friends. Fury finds an ally and acquires a major narrative component toward the end of the episode, which will certainly be important to the season finale of Secret Invasion. Who Fury calls at the end of Secret Invasion Episode 5 One of the burning questions that Secret Invasion Episode 5's ending leaves viewers with is who Fury calls. After putting his eye patch and trench coat back on, Fury calls someone and utters the words, It's time, let's finish this. The episode does not divulge who Fury is talking to on the other end of the phone which has led many to theorize who the mystery recipient could be. The likeliest outcome is that Fury was simply talking to Gravik. Secret Invasion Episode 5's earlier scenes show that Gravik and Fury have a means of contacting one another, and the two organized a meeting to settle their feud once and for all. As such, it is likely that Fury is calling Gravik to tell him that he is ready to meet now that he has retrieved the harvest from its secret location. However, it could be revealed in Secret Invasion Episode 6 that Fury was talking to someone else. Throughout Secret Invasion's five episodes thus far, the most overt references to the wider MCU have been concerning the Avengers and why Fury is not contacting anyone to help him fight the Skrulls. Similarly, Secret Invasion's many twists and turns showcase the show's willingness to include shocking revelations. To pay off these references and continue the trend of major twists, the show's finale could reveal that Fury was talking to an Avenger to come and help. The lines Fury spoke on the phone in Secret Invasion Episode 5's ending do apply to Gravik but could easily be reckoned to show him asking for aid. The most likely recipient of the phone call is Captain Marvel, who has shown to have an extra close relationship with Fury in the MCU. Regardless, MCU fans will need to wait until Secret Invasion Episode 6 airs for the reveal of who was on the other end of Fury's ultimatum. Why Fury puts his eye patch back on. Fury dons his recognizable eye patch once more in the series' finale of Secret Invasion Episode 5 which links into his whole character journey. This is one of the episode's more rewarding moments. Fury has endured a continuous barrage of criticism from both his supporters and adversaries throughout Secret Invasion, who maintain that he is not the same person who previously guarded Earth. Many characters from Secret Invasion inform Fury that he has lost his touch and is no longer the capable super spy he once was which is related to Fury's crisis of faith. This change in Fury's character was mirrored by his physical appearance in Secret Invasion. The more disheveled look of Fury throughout the show has emulated the less competent version of the character, with his graying, untamed beard, and the lack of his eye patch, solidifying how little of the old Fury remains. With the end of Secret Invasion Episode 5 though, Fury regains his eye patch from one of his fake graves, alongside his black leather trench coat, and equips it for his final stand against Gravik. As a metaphor, this is intended. The famed super spy Nick Fury from the MCU's Infinity Saga is back as of the conclusion of Secret Invasion Episode 5. The Secret Invasion theme plays when Nick Fury is shown sporting his eye patch once more, confirming that this sequence is intended to show the return of the Nick Fury, that MCU characters had faith in throughout phases 1, 2, and 3.